And today's verse can be found in Colossians chapter 4, verse 6. It reads, Let your conversation be always full of grace, seasoned with salt, so that you may know how to answer everyone. Now, this chapter is loaded with wisdom as the Apostle Paul offers guidance to the Colossian church, encouraging them to be wise in their interaction with non-believers. And here in verse 6, we learn that our communication with others should always, not sometimes, but always reflect the graciousness of God, mimicking the character and kindness of our Savior. Paul then goes on to say that our conversation should be seasoned with salt. His intentional use of salt as a metaphor embodies its diverse purposes. Now, back in Paul's day, they didn't have refrigerators, so salt was used to preserve meat and prevent it from decaying. The implication here is that when our speech is seasoned with salt, we can preserve the integrity of God's word by defending the gospel without deflating the person. And by engaging in respectful conversations, we have the ability to preserve relationships. Not only does salt preserve, but the first thing that came to mind when hearing Paul's expression is its ability to enhance the flavor of food so that it is agreeable to our palates. Too much salt and it's overpowering, not enough salt and it's uninteresting, but just enough salt can enhance the flavors of any dish. And here's the thing, family, as someone who loves to cook, let me tell you, how I season my meat is not how I season my potatoes. And much like different dishes call for different amounts of salt to achieve a balanced flavor, Paul expresses at the end of this verse that each individual that crosses our path requires a distinct approach in conversation in order to reach a harmonious outcome. Remember, our approach is vital when winning people over to Christ. Our words, much like salt, can be both potent and preserving, both soothing and savory, both pleasant and poignant. So today, let our conversation be God-flavored and full of grace so that we may know how to respond to everyone.